Good day, everyone. I am Mr. Garth Reed, student ambassador in the University of Technology Jamaica and mathematics teacher in training in the School of Mathematics and Statistics. Today, we'll be looking at a CAPE Applied Mathematics Unit 2 question under Module 1, which is Discrete Mathematics. And we'll be looking at the Logic and Boolean Algebra section. All right. We'll be forced focusing on combinatorial circuits. So here we have our question below, which says write a Boolean expression for this circuit below. Okay, so let us go right into the question. So let us notice what is happening here. Now X goes through this gate here, and you should know that this is what we call the not gate, okay? So when X goes through this gate here, the output is not X, okay, not X. And Y goes through this gate, Y and Z, all right? So not X, Y and also Z goes through this gate here, all right? And that gate is what we call what? That is the AND gate, okay? So not X, Y, and Z goes through the AND gate. So what we can write is not X and Y and Z, okay? So that is the output for that gate there. And not X and Y and Z goes through this gate here now. All right, what will be the output? So this gate, we know that this is the not gate. So the output is going to be not, all right? So not, not X and Y and Z, okay? So that is the output there. Good. Let us now focus on what is happening down here. So X goes through the not gate. So we know that the output is going to be not X. Okay, and Z goes through the NOT gate here, so we know that the output here is NOT Z. Now, if you notice, NOT X is going through this gate, Y is going through this gate, and also NOT Z goes through this gate. Now, this gate is what we call the OR gate. Okay, so the output happening here is going to be not x, all right, not x, or, all right, it goes to the or gate, so it's or y, all right, or not z, okay? So it's not x or y or not z. All of those are going through the same gate, so we're using or, good. Now, finally, we can now determine the Boolean expression of this circuit to find out what is the output happening here, okay? So you realize that not, not X and Y and Z is going through this gate here, and also not X or Y or not Z is also going through this gate, all right? This is what we call the AND gate. So what we will now have is this. So we have not, not X, and Y and Z, okay? So we have that and, all right? That's the AND gate, so we're gonna have and this, all right? Which is not X or Y or not Z, okay? And that is the output there. So that is our Boolean expression for this circuit. So we need to write a final statement now. So we can now say that therefore, all right, the Boolean expression is, all right, is going to be not, not X, and y and z all right 
and we're gonna have not x or y or not z. Okay, that is our solution to this question. All right, this is logic and Boolean algebra, and we have just solved a combinatorial circuit question. If this video was helpful for you, please ensure to like this video, subscribe to the channel for more videos, all right, and also share it with your friends. I am Mr. Garth Reed, student ambassador in the University of Technology Jamaica and mathematics teacher in training in the School of Mathematics and Statistics. I thank you for joining.